Las Vegas, the city of extravagance and endless entertainment, has always been synonymous with grandeur. But what if I told you that beneath the neon lights and shimmering casinos, there are colossal mega projects quietly taking shape? These are not your everyday constructions, they are the future of Vegas, where bigger is always better. So, have you ever wondered what's lurking beyond the iconic Las Vegas Strip? What's being built to surpass even your wildest imagination? Join us as we unveil the biggest mega projects under construction in Las Vegas, where reality transcends imagination. Las Vegas in Transformation Las Vegas finds itself in the midst of a transformative phase that has the potential to reshape the city's skyline and enhance its global reputation. In recent years, Las Vegas has been a magnet for professional sports leagues and top-tier entertainers, hosting world-class performances. As the city prepares to welcome new attractions, it must expand its infrastructure. Before Las Vegas can realize its complete potential, it must address transportation, accommodations, and other logistical challenges. This week, the Las Vegas Convention and Visitors Authority disclosed details about the city's future trajectory. In 2021, Las Vegas welcomed 32.2 million visitors, marking a remarkable 70% year-over-year surge from 2020, a period when the coronavirus pandemic had its most significant impact. However, the city's convention sector experienced a more modest rebound, with 2.2 million attendees recorded in 2021, reflecting a 28% year-over-year increase. Now, let's delve into the forthcoming developments for these desert gambling haven. Future Developments The Las Vegas Convention and Visitors Authority has outlined plans for an estimated investment of $4.512 billion in 29 upcoming projects. These initiatives are set to introduce 7,602 additional hotel rooms and expand convention space by 791,000 square feet in southern Nevada, all slated for completion by the close of 2024. As 2024 draws to a close, Las Vegas is poised to boast over 158,000 hotel rooms. Anticipating an upswing this spring, the LVCVA foresees the addition of 766 more rooms with a reopening of the Palms Resort and Casino, now under the management of new proprietors, the San Manuel Band of Mission Indians. In addition, a Holiday Inn Express is set to contribute another 127 rooms. The most substantial undertaking on the horizon is the Fontainebleau, Las Vegas, located on the Strip. This grand hotel is slated to encompass 3,780 hotel rooms and 550,000 square feet of meeting space upon its completion in the fourth quarter of 2023. The $3.7 billion Fontainebleau Las Vegas Resorts construction, long delayed due to financial and legal setbacks, is now complete and set to open officially in late 2023. This ultra-luxury mega-resort hotel, the first of its kind in Las Vegas in 15 years, stands 68 stories tall, making it the second tallest building in Las Vegas and Nevada after Stratosphere Tower. Spanning over 2.75 million square meters on the north end of the Las Vegas Strip, its proximity to the Las Vegas Convention Center makes it ideal for business travelers and conferences. The resort features a vast 32,000-square-meter main ballroom and luxurious guest rooms with floor-to-ceiling windows and upscale furnishings. With 30 food and beverage outlets, a 52,700-square-meter casino, and two levels of luxury retail shopping seamlessly integrated within the resort, it promises a unique experience. While details about the main nightclub are limited, it is expected to become one of the hottest clubs in Las Vegas, featuring an exceptional day club on the 8-acre pool deck. This ambitious mega casino positioned on the North Strip forms a pivotal component of the broader initiative to revitalize this northern sector of the 4.2-mile stretch. It carries significant weight as it, along with a potential new North Strip arena and other casino ventures, presents a viable alternative to the dominant casinos of Caesars Entertainment and MGM Resorts International situated in the Central and Southern Strip. The resort is set to transform North Vegas, an area known for its quieter atmosphere. Its striking design is a result of collaboration between renowned firms, including Carlos Zapata Studio, 
Bergman, Walls & Associates, Peter Arnell NYC-based Rockwell Group, and London-based David Collins Studio. Caesars has an extensive project in the works involving the renovation of its Bally's property, which will be rebranded under the horseshoe name. MGM2 has significant developments on the horizon, with plans to assume control of the Cosmopolitan, although the company has not disclosed any major alterations for that establishment. Opening in late 2023, the $750 million 71-acre Durango Station Casino and Hotel, located on Durango Drive in southwest Las Vegas, is an impressive off-strip destination. Inspired by the desert's warm colors and vibrant landscapes, the resort boasts a 25,300-square-meter casino space that seamlessly integrates indoor and outdoor social areas. It includes a hotel tower with over 200 luxury guest rooms, 15 restaurants, including four signature outlets, state-of-the-art race and sports book, serene pool area with private cabanas and event lawn, 6,100 square meters of meeting and convention space, 40 electric vehicle charging stations, multiple bike lanes with ample bike parking, and various amenities catering to both tourists and locals. Upon arrival, guests will encounter natural stone-clad floors and walls. The hotel lobby exudes a relaxed ambiance that seamlessly transitions into the lobby bar, offering cozy nooks, comfortable sofas, and unique art pieces for conversations, relaxation, and a sense of place. The state-of-the-art resort also features an impressive double-sided marquee display measuring 18 meters in height and 16 meters in width, with high-resolution technology boasting over 6 million color LED pixels to illuminate the casino site with engaging content pieces. Despite construction commencing in 2022, with over 14,000 cubic meters of concrete and 625 tons of steel used, the resort is nearly complete and scheduled to open in November 2023, subject to regulatory approval. The $1.9 billion MSG Sphere at the Venetian is an entertainment venue with a seating capacity of 17,500, and it is set to be finalized by the end of 2023. Simultaneously, six fresh properties are on track to be completed in 2024, with the most substantial being the 720-room, non-gaming Majestic Las Vegas, constructed at a cost of $850 million and situated across the West Hall of the Las Vegas Convention Center. Additionally, the $500 million Dream Las Vegas, featuring 527 rooms, is also slated for completion in 2024. To cater the influx of potential tourists, several transportation projects are currently in progress. These include an $8 billion high-speed rail initiative and a 29-mile 51-station Las Vegas Loop underground transit project led by Elon Musk's The Boring Company. If you're enjoying it so far, hit the subscribe button. Now, let's continue. Our next venture doesn't revolve around resorts or hotels, but focuses on transportation infrastructure. Las Vegas and Los Angeles share a unique connection, with a substantial number of travelers frequently journeying between the two cities, primarily by car. To address this demand, a collaborative effort has resulted in the $8 billion Brightline West high-speed rail project featuring a two-story Las Vegas station covering 65,000 square feet. This all-electric high-speed rail service will include key stations in Las Vegas, Apple Valley, Hesperia, and Rancho Cucamonga, operating at speeds of 300 kilometers per hour. Passengers can travel from Las Vegas to Rancho Cucamonga in just two hours and 10 minutes, cutting the normal driving time in half. Notably, this project is lauded as an environmental milestone, as it's expected to reduce carbon dioxide emissions by over 400,000 tons annually. The Rancho Cucamonga station will also connect to Southern California's regional Metrolink service, enabling swift and seamless travel to downtown Los Angeles and beyond. The project received its final approval in July 2023, with construction commencing later that year. It's slated to become operational as early as January 2027. A substantial portion of Las Vegas' expansion is originating from sectors beyond its conventional gaming industry. Professional Sports Hub The city is currently experiencing a surge in professional sports exemplified by the recent inclusion of NFL and NHL franchises. Major League Baseball has been in discussions with the city, seeking to secure a new stadium agreement for the Oakland Athletics. 
The A's have engaged in negotiations with multiple locations on or near the Las Vegas Strip. Moreover, there are reports suggesting that the NBA might consider awarding the city an expansion team in the coming years. Speculations have also arisen about the possibility of Las Vegas adding a major league soccer team, although there have been no official announcements regarding concrete plans. Las Vegas could potentially evolve into an even more prominent sports hub in the midst of the desert, complementing the city's abundant entertainment offerings. If you like this video, click the next one shown on the screen. I'm sure you'll like it. Thanks for watching.